Hello, my name is Kirk Vodopals. I'm a hydrologist. I'd like to talk to you today about watershed restoration. A properly functioning watershed is able to drain rainfall down to a stream or a river without excess sedimentation or erosion. It also provides aquatic habitat for sensitive species. Most of our restoration work is in coho watersheds. Upgrading and decommissioning roads is a major component of watershed restoration. Road upgrading and decommissioning reduces the hydrologic connectivity to the stream network and thus improves fish habitat. Decommissioning a road requires that two factors are met. A road is a candidate for decommissioning if it is no longer required for timber harvest and if it is significantly impacting the stream network. All of the roads that are required for timber harvesting are upgraded to reduce their connectivity to the stream network. Fish passage is another key component to watershed restoration. All barriers are assessed for their degree of blockage and how much habitat is upstream of the barrier. Some barriers can be restored by placing logs or boulders in the stream, while others need to have a larger culvert or a bridge installed to restore fish passage. Another method to restoring watersheds is to place logs into a stream to create deeper pools and cover for fish. These deep, cool pools provide habitat during the low flow period and are of particular benefit during drought years. There are many tools to restore watersheds, but the goal is always the same, to provide cold, clear water for coho salmon and other sensitive aquatic species.